And in this video, I'm gonna share my four go-to health and fitness apps that you need to download from the App Store this year. Don't forget to stick to the end if you wanna see my top overall health and fitness app for 2022. Now, similar to my video from 2020, I'm gonna share my favorite apps from each of the top four health categories. And I'll be honest, they have definitely changed a lot from what I used back then. So starting with the best workout app, Apple Fitness Plus, which was literally one of my favorite all-time workout apps to use last year, and it was my saving grace during the pandemic. What I love about it is there are a ton of workouts that have a, a lot of variety to them, like dance, rowing, cycling, hit workouts, Pilates. They have fun and personable trainers that push you, but also give you modifications if you need to tailor things back a bit. They also have a ton of add-ons, such as the new meditation practices, as well as the celebrity time to walk guest speakers such as Prince William and Shawn Mendes. And what's really cool is it syncs with your Apple Health app where you can see a summary of all your different stats and trends after each workout. And on top of that, you can share the membership with your family members if you've already enabled family sharing through your Apple account. Now this does lead me to the one negative knock on Apple Fitness Plus, which is it's only accessible through Apple devices and it only works if you have an Apple Watch Series 3 or later. But other than that, there's really no major issues. It's reliable, it's updated weekly, and it could literally be the only workout app that you need to stay fit at any time and at any location. Moving to my next favorite app for nutrition, which used to be my fitness pal, but now is an app called Yumly. It actually isn't the most well-known app out there, but if you've heard of it, let me know in the comments below. This year, I really wanted to step up my cooking game. I got a fiance now, so I got to show I can do some work in the kitchen. Look at Aries. Look at the flick at Aries. Now, what I love about Yumly is the fact that it has a ton of recipes to choose from. You could choose from different trending dishes or different cuisine styles. And then once you pick your dish or recipe, you can actually see all the ingredients that you need for your desired dish and you get to see the nutritional facts for the stated serving sizes. And what's really neat is if you scroll down, you can also see the different reviews from the other Yumly users who took a stab at making that same dish. They also have really good quality video guided cooking sessions that you can follow step by step to create a new or favorite dish. But what is probably my favorite part about Yumly is the fact that you can plan your meals for the week and also automatically translate those ingredients to a digital grocery list on your phone that you could check off when you're shopping for foods. Now, I do wish I was able to keep keep track of the foods I was eating and see the collective amount of carbs, proteins, and fats I had in a day, similar to what my fitness pal allows you to do. But honestly, that can sometimes take the fun out of eating healthy. And that's what I love about Yumly. It makes cooking and eating healthy, fun, and enjoyable. Now, when it came to my favorite sleep tracking app, it was a close race, but the one that came out on top was Whoop. I actually made a video about the Whoop 3.0 a little while back, and it definitely impressed me as a sleep tracker. However, I do want to provide a quick note that you do need a Whoop device in order to use the actual app itself because it isn't a standalone sleep tracker. Out of all the apps I've used, the Whoop app is top notch when it comes to sleep monitoring. You could track your overall sleep performance, your actual time spent in bed awake versus sleeping, and you could see how many interruptions you had when you're sleeping, and you could track your sleep efficiency. I especially love the recovery tracking, which focuses on your heart rate variability, your resting heart rate, your quality of sleep, and your respiratory rate to give you a collective recovery score out of 100% to help you know if you recovered from the day before. They also have other cool sleep tracking features such as the sleep coach, which helps determine a suggested bedtime and the total amount of sleep need in order for you to perform at your best. And they also have smart alarms that trigger your whoop band to make sure that you wake up when you had an optimal amount of sleep. Lastly, one of my favorite features from the whoop app is their performance assessments, which come in weekly and monthly, and they let you know which habits and behaviors led to your average quality sleep over time. They even just released a year in review recapping my total sleep metrics over the entire past year. And trust me, I need to do better this year. I need to do a lot better. I highly recommend you check out Whoop if you haven't already. I've included a referral link in the description below that you can use to get a free month of Whoop if you're interested in trying it out. And for the fourth app, given the growing interest in wellness and mindfulness over the last few years, I wanted to include my favorite meditation app, Calm. I actually have a dope in-depth review of the Calm app that I made a couple weeks ago, and I think I'm gonna do a head-to-head -head between Calm and Headspace, so make sure you're subscribed to the channel and you turn that notification bell on to make sure you're not missing out on any of my future videos. And what I love about Calm is the variety of meditations that help you to improve your productivity and your focus, and help you manage anxiety and building better relationships. And another 
huge part of the app is actually their sleeping features, which include sleep stories from famous celebrities like LeBron James and Idris Elba. And they also have different background music options from instrumentals to movie inspired soundtracks like Dune. It is literally what has helped me get through some stressful times at the end of last year. And I definitely became a believer in meditation after going through their 30 day learn how to meditate series. So I definitely recommend you check it out. And since you stay to the end of this video, I will share my overall favorite fitness app, best in show for 2022, which is Fitbit. Now, yes, it does require a Fitbit device, but it is totally worth it because this app literally has everything. It keeps track of your standard health metrics, such as your total activity and calories burned, your sleep quality, your readiness score, your stress and anxiety levels, your total number of mindfulness minutes and sessions, and even your collective water and nutrition intake. And with their pro membership, you get access to their various workout videos and meditation sessions. You get suggested recipes and meal inspirations, along with being able to participate in guided programs that help improve your desired health habits, such as eating healthier, or improving your sleep. You even get the opportunity to join Fitbit communities that you can be a part of where the Fitbit members help provide support and motivation when it comes to reaching those same health and fitness goals. Whenever someone asks me about my favorite app, I tell them no question, the Fitbit app, it's literally like the gold standard for fitness apps. Now, I do wish their wearables were a bit better, similar to like an Apple Watch, but since Google did purchase Fitbit, we could see some dope devices in the future. Stay tuned for my Fitbit Charge 5 review where I dive a little bit deeper to everything that Fitbit has to offer. Now look, honestly, any of these apps will help start moving you into the right direction. The first step you need to take is just heading to the app store and pressing download. Remember, action is really your number one ally in achieving your desired health and fitness goals this year. I believe in you, I'm rooting for you. Stay tuned for more videos to come. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and compile that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, stay healthy and embrace the hype. Woo!